This is the Smith Machine deadlift. This is primarily going to work your hamstrings, your glutes, and your lower back. Your secondary muscles that we'll be working to help stabilize are going to be your quads, your upper back, and your core. To start with, we are going to position the Smith Machine so that we can use it for a deadlift by placing your stoppers. These are your safety bars. These are going to go to the bottom, and then we're going to place the barbell at the bottom by unhooking it and then bringing it to the bottom here. Next, you're going to stand with your shins about touching the bar, pretty close, and you're going to be about shoulder width apart here. So it doesn't have to be super far. You can play around with your foot positioning as well to feel what feels best for you. So if a little bit wider stance helps you to get into the position better, then totally do that. And if you're feeling uncomfortable about the deadlift, go ahead and send me a form video from the side, and this will help me to see where you need some help. So next we're going to do an overhand grip here that is a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. So you can see that it's on the outsides of my knees and I'm bending at my hips and letting my knees bend as well. So next I am going to engage my core, making sure to keep my back straight. And then I'm going to lift the bar by straightening my hips and my knees until I come to a standing position like this. and then I'm right into another rep. So I'm squeezing my glutes at the top here and then slowly lowering the bar back down to the starting position. Some common mistakes that I wanna take you through so that you don't end up making these are the first one being your back rounding. So whenever you go down, you will see that my back is staying flat the entire time. You don't want to have your back rounding. That might mean that you're not engaging your core or engaging your lats properly. And if that is happening, then I can help you out with some strengthening exercises and with some specific exercises to help with the deadlift. The next mistake is using your arms to lift. So if you're relying on your arms to lift the bar instead of your lower body, then you want to focus on driving your heels through the ground and using your hips and your legs to lift the weight, okay? You might feel some in your lower back, and that's totally okay. If you are feeling a lot of this motion in your lower back, it just means that your lower back needs some work, okay? It's, it needs some strength. And this is going to help with that. So I would suggest lowering the weight down slightly. And then maybe we can do some extra lower back workouts so that you can get some strength there. And then eventually you're going to find that you feel this more in your legs as your lower back strengthens up. And then last is going to be hyperextending at the top. So you're gonna see that when I get to the top of this motion, I am standing straight up and down. My hips aren't forward to where my hips are like this. I'm not way overextending my hips to where I'm like leaning back. So that is what you want to make sure to avoid. And the way that you can fix this is just to make sure that you're squeezing your glutes without leaning back, keeping your spine neutral. Please let me know if you have any questions on this exercise and get to Smith Machine deadlifting. You're going to love it. It's going to strengthen all around. And once you're ready, we can go into a regular deadlift.